Hey, all Supernatural fans. Uh, I'm doing another video on our car, which we call Sadie. Uh, and we also have a shop dog named Sadie now. So uh, for some reason, Don's girlfriend, Vicky, is really big on the name Sadie. But so anyway, uh, I've, been got, I've gotten a lot of questions and stuff on this. So it's easier for me to do a video and try to answer everything. Um, some of the questions is, can you buy the car as is? And the answer is yes on that. Uh, there's also questions, can you finish, can we finish it out? The answer is also yes on that. Um, as it sits, uh, just go over everything. The bodywork is completely done. The car is sitting in primer. All metal work has been done on this car. The car right now has, as a way it sits, is the 454 is now sitting in it. And the 400 turbo transmission is now uh, in it. The firewall has been painted black. Uh, we're going to put in, and when I say as is, as it sits right now, that will come with a new heater core, new blower motor. The, we're going to take a um, suitcase, I call it the suitcase, that covers this here, that goes to, this car was a non-AC car, so it'll have the suitcase that matches the AC car, even though it'll be a non-functional AC. And... Um, it has the new A-arms put on, new springs, new bushings. Uh, we have new steering and everything for this car linkage. And the only thing, you're going to see it's got the drum brakes on it. Uh, when the car sells, it will have disc brakes on We just put the drum brakes on it because we're probably going to roll this around and try to get it out of the way. Uh, the new rag joint has not been put on, which goes right there. So... The engine is out of an 85 Chevy uh, Suburban. It was a two-wheel drive, but it was a 454 engine, and the engine runs actually really good. Um, so what we're going to do is the scuttlebutt here in the, the shop is that we want to put a new timing chain, new water pump. We're going to put the correct pulleys on it, and um, we'll put the chrome valve covers. It'll be painted the hot rod red. Uh, we've got, we'll put the cap and the, the distributor on this thing was actually really good. So we're going to put a red cap on it, uh, run the red plugs, new uh, plug wires. And then we're going to go a little off the reservation with this one. Uh, we're going to put headers on this one. So a, a hot jet coated header, uh, just for a little bit more power. And then we're talking about uh, changing out the fuel pump. Now, if somebody is wanting to buy this as is because we got to pull this out oh and the transmission is going to get new seals new gasket you know painted up and everything uh but if somebody wants while we have this out and they go hey we're going to buy this but would you put on the correct intake the correct carb and a bigger cam in it well in fact we might put a big cam in it uh and it'll be a competition cam and i'll tell you right now we're looking at the mother thumper the mother thumper is what they call it and uh, it'll be the choppy idle and because that's I don't like a, a real lopy lopy cam and so I like it you know where it beats good against the uh, uh, the pavement so that's what it'll have and also right now um, like I said this has got to come out because as I've mentioned in other videos this has to have a 1967 Impala big block oil pan on it and it is sitting right over here um, on the bench um, so it'll be on there be painted and you know the whole nine yards so that is with the engine like I said the firewall dons painted black the frames already been blasted and painted uh, all new bushings so right now like I said we just have the drums on it because it'll probably be rolling around what we're also talking about doing is because this is a non AC car um, we're going to put in an AC dash uh, panel and we're going to get this all painted the buckskin and then we'll put the glass back in it the back glass will be also put in um, I will have the package tray in this car and so that way and then it'll be all done now if you go hey I want to buy this would you put in the the weapons box yes I will it'll just be an additional charge and stuff <clears throat> so interior will all be put in it it will be just the stock gold you know nothing fancy no headliner nothing like that no carpet but that way 
you know, basically you're saving money if you're buying it as is. Um, all the uh, trim, we can put it back on the car or we can leave it off and label it, bag it, you know, put it in the trunk uh, in case you're like, hey, I want to go get this thing painted. Um, so there's options for you. Um, it will not come with new window seals or nothing like that uh, or trunk seals. And that will be up to you. Tires will be just rollers. Uh, if you want to pay extra, and it'll be just the the cost that if you went out and bought them yourself. Uh, but you know we can we could get them ordered, put in here, put you know get a mounted balance, put on the car. You know if you want to go that route. Uh, if you want also to have our exhaust shop do the uh, exhaust work, you know we can do that. Uh, basically it's kind of you can pick and choose or just take it as is put together uh, and when it comes uh, out you know it'll be a running car so as is will be a running car um, and you know it'll lo load up on a trailer and you can take over the the project uh, all the glass will be in the doors you know doors are on we'll put the the door handles back on uh, if if you don't want them on then all you have to do is say hey don't put that stuff on because I'm going to take it to a shop and get it painted and da 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 da. But we figured we'd go ahead and put the glass and everything back in, get them all sealed up. And when before we do that, it will be all painted black, you know, in there. And then we'll get them installed. So that way, uh, if the new owner wants to have it painted, uh, you know, if they want to paint it themselves or whatever, you can just tape off the glass and you will not have to pull that out. Um, so. Well, you know what? I take that back. You would have to to pull put the uh, headliner in. So, and it's something we can talk about. We can always uh, we may not put the front windshield in because of that, uh, but we can always tape bubble wrap it and put it in the back seat. And you know, I uh, just thought of that. The headliner does have to the glass has to be out for the headliner. So, anyway, I get lots of questions, and unfortunately, my time has been really been eaten up here lately. And so I just don't get to sit down and answer everybody's questions. So it's just easier for me to do it on a video. Uh, a lot of people are asking too, like, well, how much, how much as is, blah, blah, blah. The car, like I said, running, I'll pay everything I just talked about is $30,000. And I know a lot of people are going to go, holy shit, $30,000. Uh, trust me, body work is expensive. And this thing, there's no hidden Bondo in it or anything like that. It's all steel and it's the turbo 400 it's the big block it's the 12 bolt rear end um like i said everything i talked about guys i i just don't see how you could beat it uh, i know there's some cars on ebay right now uh for i think one's forty thousand, and one might be twenty five thousand. uh they're gonna need body work i promise you they're gonna need body work every one of these cars needs body work I got a car out of New York, and it's in really gorgeous shape. Guess what? It needs body work. Uh, I have never seen a car that does not need body work. And these things are notorious for holding moisture and everything else. So with that being said, I know it sounds like a lot of money. Now, if you want it all finished out, you know, and you're wanting certain things and blah, 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 you know, we can talk about that. That will just be, you know, additional cost. And usually how... I do it, you know, if you're like, hey, I want the intake, I want the, the Holly Avenger carb, I want the k and air filter, da 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 all that. I will just send you the places to buy that. You buy it, you send it here, we'll put it on, uh, we'll build the car, you know, obviously there'll be labor in charge on that, but, uh, but everything I mentioned, you know, the dash, um, the heater core, the disc brakes, all that stuff will be on the car. So you can start this thing up, and I don't think I would probably go Tilly and down the road too far because uh, that is not going to include an alignment on it or, you know, or an exhaust system on it. So with that being said, um, it's up to you on how far you want to take it. But I beg to differ with anybody uh, that they can show me a better car with the, all the options that I just said that has all the body work done for a lower price. If you can do that, boy, I will eat a hat on camera. So I know it's expensive. Not everybody can do it, but this one is ready. 
I know it's just kind of sitting here. We could actually get this done pretty fast. Uh, it's just that we've been doing some other things in the shop, uh, which I'm going to do a video here on real quick. So anyway, that's for everybody that's been interested in this car. And we will uh, let's let it go and we'll see what happens. And if not, we're just going to keep working on it. And we might do more things to it. Uh, that I did not mention and obviously if we do more and spend more money on it then uh, more you know the price has got to go up so um, you know like I said this is a probably a, a really really good buy-in I, I probably couldn't stress that enough and once again I get it not everybody has thirty thousand dollars sitting around in their bank account so uh, I understand that but this is for the person that has to have hero one and um, and obviously, I would say the person that can do a lot of work themselves. So uh, I, I know I got a few, or at least one or two people interested in the car. Um, it, it might sell after this video. I don't know, but you can always put your two cents in. And uh, but if you like, don't have the money, guys, keep your comments to yourself. Not everybody plays in the same ballpark. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, I can't play in some other ballparks because I don't have that type of money. So I get it. I'm not trying to be mean or anything like that. Uh, like I said, there are some ballparks I'd like to play in. Can't afford to play in them. And this is, you know, this is an expensive ballpark. Uh, and then if, obviously if this car was painted black and everything was done on it, it gets even to a more expensive ballpark. So that's just the way it goes. And everybody knows our reputation on how we build these cars and we take great pride in them, and I never leave anything out. I just tell you the way it is, and that's how it goes. So if you are interested, you want to be a serious player, you want to talk, um, you know, let me know, and uh, we'll just go from there. So thanks, for guys, for listening to the video, and I've got to make some other shop videos. So talk to you later. Bye.